as heat wave number seven hits just in time for the holiday weekend, many Kern County residents are expected to make their way to the river or take a trip to the central coast. But as 17th's Taylor Schaub explains, there are many health and safety risks involved with large Labor Day gatherings. He's joining us live this morning to tell us more about the warning from officials. Taylor? Well, good morning, Maddie. Whether you're planning on a barbecue or heading to the beach or even going to the Kern County River, as we said, local law enforcement and even public health, well, they're concerned about the risks that that could pose. As the temperature soars past 105 this holiday weekend, Kern County residents will no doubt look to beat the heat any way they can. A concern for neighboring counties like San Luis Obispo, who saw a spike in cases after both Memorial Day and the 4th of July. We did see a small spike after Memorial Day weekend, and we did see a small spike again after July 4th weekend. Um, it's anticipated that we could see a spike again. Michelle Shoresman understands that Pismo Beach is a staple for those traveling from the Central Valley looking to escape for the unofficial final week of summer. But much like in May when they launched a digital campaign discouraging tourism, she's asking folks to follow the state's guidelines and once again stay home to stop the spread. Those are still pro prohibited activities under the most recent version of the state order. That warning didn't stop hundreds from hopping on Highway 166 during Memorial Day weekend, including Kern County resident Josh Vera, who strongly disagreed with that stance back then. I think everybody's just trying to have fun. Everybody's tired of being home. I feel like people should just have fun. Like, there's no reason to stop everything you're doing just because of you hear something on the news or like the government says something. There is still a concern for those staying within county lines. KCSO fears that the 178 will be packed with people making their way to the Kern River, where we've already seen multiple drownings this year. We encourage people to not go in the river if they don't know how to swim or if they don't have a life jacket. Zach Biddle, a sergeant with KCSO's search and rescue crew, says they'll be fully staffed for the holiday. And we obviously, we do not encourage people to do anything that's going to put themselves in danger because then our search and rescue volunteers have to be deployed and they're all volunteers and they go out and risk their life for um, somebody who maybe made a poor decision near the river. So regardless of your plans for the long weekend, these local agencies are just asking you to stay safe. And remember, we're in the midst of a pandemic. Now, it's important to note that San Luis Obispo County did shut down uh, some of their hotels and limit some of the travel during Memorial Day weekend. They're not doing any of that. They're just asking people to please um, stay home and be responsible this weekend. In Southwest Bakersfield, Taylor Schaub, 17 News.